What's going on, YouTube? BD Kane 721. Happy Monday morning, 19th of April. It's going to be a beautiful day here in San Diego as normal for this month of the year. Uh, should be, whoops, should be somewhere in the 80s during midday and getting down to the 60s and 50s at night. Going to the park tonight to watch the pa uh, Padres play the Brew Crew. Uh, first game in about a week and a half that I've been to. I've sold our other season tickets, uh, especially over the weekend to the Dodgers. So it was a great series. Only took one of three. Uh, all three games could have gone either way. So I was happy to watch it and just, you know, we'll, we'll keep at it with the Dodgers. We play them next weekend too. So it'll be, it'll be interesting to watch that in LA. I got a package in over the weekend from Mike O. Uh, I don't know if I had mentioned in any of my previous videos that I was sending a couple cards in to SGC through Mike uh, over in, uh, in their Facebook group. And I wanted to give it a shot. You know, PSA is, is not accepting any submissions right now. And um, I wanted to give another grading company a chance. And obviously with Mike O and JT doing such a great job, I figured I'd give SGC a try. Mike O's reveal video, I linked it below. You can check it out. It was such a quick turnaround. I couldn't believe how quickly it was. I think it might have been like three weeks or something. I didn't watch the reveal video, actually, because I like to open these things blind. I actually opened the package here, but I haven't looked at it. So here's the... I only sent in two cards this time. Um, both of them, not nothing big. Just a couple of cards I had in my collection I thought would look good in a slab. And I forget, actually, I think it might have been, it might have been uh, one 2017 Topps Chrome, maybe one 2016. I actually forget who I sent in, which I think is a little, a little ridiculous, but I'm going to see if I can do this without looking at the grade and show them, show the grade together with you. Okay, so there's the back. Hopefully both of them are. So I sent in... A 2017 Topps Chrome Trey Turner Blue, which is numbered out of 150. I don't know if that's going to focus all that well or not. There it is. So that's numbered out of 150. And then I also sent in a Pete Alonzo. That's what I sent in. A Pete Alonzo card from 2020. Uh, both of these, I believe, are Rookie Cup cards. And they looked pretty good to me. Uh, I don't really know uh, how hard G SGC is to get 10s. I seem to believe that it might be a little harder to get 10s with SGC, but that's, that's, a, that's a very uh, novice opinion. So here's the Pete Alonzo. Again, it's 2020 Topps Chrome Blue, number to 150, and it is a rookie cup. 9.5 not too bad i'm actually uh, there's my name obviously but uh that is really cool i i was expecting at least a nine on these cards and knowing my luck with the way the psa submittal went last time um i might not get tens because i got i got what did i get eight tens out of nine cards in my psa submission that came back a few weeks ago so this is cool. I just love, I love this card. Love this shot. Rookie Cup. Awesome look for him. Hopefully he has a good season this year. I haven't really kept track of how he's doing. I also like the fact that SGC puts the number. Um, sorry for the glare. But puts the actual number of the card on the... Is it going to ever focus? There we go. Puts the number of the card, of the serial number. On the uh, stamp here, on the on the little, I don't know what you call that, label. That's pretty cool. I don't think PSA does that. All right, so that's card number one. Trey Turner is 2017. Uh, I slow, I kind of PC Trey Turner a little bit years ago because I really liked him and he was a, he was an ex Padre. Uh, system guy and I don't know thought he would have been good for the for the Padres but 
It does have a little corner issue right here. I can already see, and I think I saw that when I sent it in. So I'm not expecting a 10 on this one. I'm hoping to get at least a 9. If it's an 8.5, I won't be too surprised. So let's see what we got. Oh, I did get a 10. Very cool. Wow. I mean, I looked at I looked at the card. I remember seeing this little white corner spot here on the back. Maybe they don't look at the back as well as, as hard as they look at the front. So I'm really excited about that. Cool, guys. That's awesome. Um, I think he he's an underrated player in the major leagues. Um, used to be a Padre. I think we traded him. Gosh, I wish I had done my research before I started this video, but uh, I think we might have traded him right around 2015, 2016. And I'm trying to remember what we got for him. I don't. 100% remember. It might have been like Brad Hand or somebody like that way back when. So, wow, I'm a little surprised on that one and pleasantly surprised on the Alonzo. So, all right, guys, if you like the video, remember my name is Saul. Uh, give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and I will talk to you guys soon got another mail day coming up this weekend so, or this week so i will uh, i'll fill you in then talk to you soon see you